Hello guys, we are going to draw Goteng Super Saiyan 3 today. Let's start it with uh, his hair. There will be two spikes upon his head. Like this. And then one between it. Like this. And we will draw the other spikes. We will use this guideline to help us. Now let's draw his, his face. For eyes we will draw three lines and remember the last line will be curved. the nodes and the mouth I will do some adjustments. Done. Then Ears. Done. Then we'll draw his jacket. Let's draw his jacket. 
एंड इज आम For the fingers, we'll draw a guideline. Then one by one, we'll draw the fingers. And now we'll draw the knuckles. Once we are done, we'll draw his another arm and the other side. same guideline for the other once you are done draw the knuckles Now let's draw his biceps and his abs. Now let's draw his uh, remaining spikes. Once you are done, remove the guidelines. Now we will draw his lower body. First we will draw a simple guideline for this. Then we will add details to it.
I refer you guys to use a reference for this because if we use a reference the drawing will be more clear and accurate. Now let's draw his shoes. Okay, we are done. Done drawing. We will start the inking process. You can use any black pen for this. I am using a Faber Castle 0.2 black pen. Take take your time to do this step because it is very the main step of your drawing. I will fast forward this for you. Okay, once we are done, we can erase all, all the other lines. Once you are done erasing, we color this. I am using Faber Castle connector pen 50 shades. First, we will color the hair. I will use light yellow first once you are done we can do the shading we don't need Copic markers to blend, blend colors. We can use any markers. The light source is from that, that direction. So we have to do the dark color at the opposite direction. Once you are done, we will color the skin. Once you are done, we will shade this darker areas. Once we are done, we will blend these colors.
we'll use a even darker shade for a little shading now we'll color the other skin areas with the same color don't worry if the colors don't blend we will blend it later i will show show you a, a simple trick to blend this color without the blender now color the eyes now let's color the tongue now we'll head on to its jacket Awesome, let's color his belt. Now let's color his arm bracelets. we are done i was talking about the tip about blending the colors 
it is oil pastels or you can use wax crayons as well we'll take the skin color and put it here and then rub it with your finger carefully look it blend perfectly do it for unblended areas if you are to uh, lighten a color you can use white oil pastel like this thank you for watching my video like share and subscribe this video